What is going on everyone? Today we're all superstars with these white and cream shell toes that we have on deck. First off, let me say getting these shoes was ridiculous. I have beef with the third party shipping company, Laser Ship. Beef with you guys. I ordered these like three weeks ago. Somehow, when I checked my tracking, they had been accidentally rerouted to New Jersey. Then a couple days later, I signed on to Adidas and they say that we're sorry, we couldn't deliver your package for some reason, but we're processing your order as a return. So I'm like, okay, whatever, that sucks. But at least I get my money back. But hold on, because a few days later, I see nothing is happening. I'm not getting my money back. I don't know what's going on. Then about four days after that, I find an email in my inbox from LaserShip that says, your package has been delivered. It was left at the shipping dock sign, which I live in a residential neighborhood. There are no shipping docks here. So I go outside, look for the package. It's not there. So I come in, get on my computer, go to LaserShip.com, type in, where is my damn package? So, Laser Ship says they are opening an investigation. Okay, cool. So a few days pass, I don't hear anything. So I call Laser Ship and I ask the employee, where is my box? He says it's in Kentucky and it will be here by the end of the day, which it wasn't. So the next day I get an email from Laser Ship telling me that the package was indeed delivered to my house. They have concluded their investigation. So I emailed them back and I said, you're full of shit. So they emailed me immediately back and said, we're sorry, we're opening another investigation. So the day after Thanksgiving, I wake up and they're finally on my front porch. But my hatred for laser ship still lingers like the stench of an overfilled garbage truck. Hate you guys. I do have a history of the superstar video I'm working on, so I'll skip the history portion of this review for a change, and you guys can check that out. Hopefully, I'll get it done before Christmas, but who knows. So, on to this shoe. I was browsing the Adidas site, and there were no skate shoes on sale, which immediately led me to the classics, and this one caught my eye for some reason. Honestly, a lot of the Shelto's offered, I'm not really a fan of, just because the quality of materials has really gone downhill, I feel. They are cranking those puppies out, plastic tongues and all. I can't handle those big, puffy, pillowy, nylon, plasticky tongues. They're like daggers to my heart. They kill me soul killing please give me a mesh tongue or the classic foam tongue if you're gonna do that just don't do it but the tongue and the materials on this colorway seemed a lot nicer than the last pair of shell toes i bought and the other ones offered currently on the adidas site they were originally a little more expensive at 110 dollars where i think the most of the shell toes are like 85 to 90 dollars so a semi-premium version, I guess you would call it. I expect better materials, wouldn't you? So let's look at these basketball, b-boy, and skateboarding legends to see if they hit different or not. The soft leather on these cloud white uppers are of a higher quality. No corners cut here, even the eye stays are leather. And you get some supple cream colored nubuck suede on the three stripes and embossed back heel tab. On the lateral hill counter sit some small gold foil graphics that show your shoe size in different countries or markets. These are all nice details that greatly improve the sneaker in my humble opinion. Another nice detail is the tongue, which resembles a gazelle tongue. It has that thinner molded foam that incorporates a textural design. A classic Adidas look and so much better than the last shell toes I bought. Just don't give me that pig plasticky tongue I keep bitching about. This logo looks good on this tongue as well in that classic bluebird color. It does hit different than the other colorways. 
The cream spills over to the shell toe and cup sole where you will find that familiar tread awaiting you on the outsole. Another nice little detail on this colorway is a clasped up insole and some blue lace aglets that pop with those other blue hits. Out of all the general releases offered right now, I feel like these are the ones to snag if you like shell toes and they're currently offered at $88 on sale last time I checked Adidas site. But you all know it's the holidays so sales are coming on and off. You guys can just keep a lookout if you're interested in these. I can't really express how much better the materials are and just how they look and feel. I don't know. A lot better than the last ones I've seen around. So, hope that helps you guys. Till next time, see ya.